doing that of real peace and respect. This video is about the Bible, the hell in the Bible is really talking about, and the suffering is really talking about the animals, nature, the forgotten, and the left behind. No one suffers in a book in that Bible like animals do. Nobody has more or has or had more sacrifices in that book like animals do. You know what I mean? Yeah, humans were sacrificed in that book, but not like animals were. Not like sheep were. Not like the lambs were. Not like chickens. Not like cows. Not like ox. Not like mule. We can keep going. Not like fish. <sighs> And to this day now, animals are suffering the most on this planet at a high intense rate like never before. So this 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 episode right here, I'm gonna talk about how the Bible relates to today's suffering of animals, slaughtering. And I'm just gonna give you the full meaning of the hell in the Bible, what they're talking about, how they explain what's going on in modern days with nature and the animals. Starting now. Okay. You have these beings is watching. They like to call up demons and angels. You know what I mean? Yeah, they so-called got wings, but they don't. But they are bright, shiny ones in their vehicles sitting above like a so-called demon angel watching all of this stuff. One by, no, I mean, soul after soul, body after body, animal after animal, and lying getting slaughtered in these buildings, even outside. Blood, heads getting sliced off, screaming of so many creatures. Screaming of so many babies, mothers. Of the suffering of mother to keep getting injected with drugs, with um, hormones to stay on their foot, steroids to stay on their feet, and so they're producing their milk for their so called babies, which is humans, grown ass humans, eating cheese from the mother, eating from the mother cow, eating from the mother cow, grown ass human beings eating from the mother cow. Let that sink into you. See, that even makes sense to your own into intuition or perception. Or you're going to let another spirit that has no intuition or perception of his or herself tell you that you made to eat from another creature's mother. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, I'm going to stay on topic. Yep, old oh, desolate land. It's getting slaughtered. These big machines, so-called human being, human man, at the damn, you know what I mean? Just forcing them in line, torturing these souls, innocent creatures, one by one. Get next, get it over here. This and that. This video is all over YouTube. Pigs don't want to go because they know what's go what's up, what's up ahead. Screaming and fear and torture and man and pain. Like any other human being or creature in, this, in existence in the third dimension would. But anyway, back to the story, the hell. Screaming and screaming. Pain and torture. Because you see, not only the family members, but the friends that they were stuck, squeezed up in the cell together with until this pain, thinking it was going to be better. But it's just going to get worse. Transported in trucks and these machines to another slaughter that destination to another place of hell house of hell Getting fed tons of drugs don't even know it jacked all up just to get sliced all up Why these beings from other dimensions and areas star systems in space just watching in their vehicles and they're not the savior. They're the, they're pretty much the ones who started this stuff. Not ain't saying all of them. The ones who just watching and you know what I mean and making sure that 
everything's going to their plant because they feed off it too. Like you see these mutilated cows and stuff like that. Yep, so so that the soul is still getting tortured as I speak now to feed these mouths of humans. And so they can feed their little kids. No good well, all they're doing is feeding monsters, little monsters. And yes, they are monsters until they develop or, and learn that they're, you know, they're not supposed to be eating like this and what they're eating and learn to listen to their body if they're lucky enough to come out of the um, to get to come out of the distraction zone which the matrix already has set up for everyone like I did but I wasn't my luck I was just bound to do it I was bound for my destiny they just whenever I like turn into it okay back to the story yep and buildings cows chickens Young male cows, all getting slaughtered just for for their so-called food, so-called food name veal. That's all male baby cows. So many mother cows just crying because they know they're getting tortured and they ain't supposed to be living like this. Even though they are, a lot of them are genetically cloned just to, just to be a, somebody else's torture. Yep, the Bible's about that. There's many of these people, beings, just watching, floating in the sky, floating and floating above, staying in st station, just watching. So that the souls getting slaughtered, 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 slaughtered. Cut, 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 cut. Scream, 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 scream. Pain, pain, blood, squirt, squirt. Suffering, 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 suffering. suffering, suffering. And they go into these heaters mouth. <laughs> they go into Chick-fil-A. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Popeye's chicken good. <laughs> and that's what y'all doing. Eating the hell and wonder why y'all be tripping and beefing. Y'all got you call it um y'all aggressive. Short short tempers. Cause y'all eating babies and drinking, and drinking baby. I mean, I mean drinking the cow mother milk, and eating baby cow food. I mean meat, nice and baby chicken meat. All mostly chickens are babies. They just grown real fast. Shot all up with hormones. And all these hormones going to y'all and y'all kids. So there you have it. And animals in the Bible, they talking about a savior for these beings. Yes, the animals does have a savior, and they do need a savior because they cannot save themselves. So yeah, they will have a savior, and a savior is coming for them. So yeah, that's what the Bible is talking about. Human don't need a savior. Savior humans to save themselves, but animals do need a savior. Animals can't save themselves. Nature. Nature can save the animals, but not the animals. Even though the animals are a part of nature, it had to be something else from nature, a higher presence in nature, like me or somebody else. Do I know the rule? Peace and respect.